What if Texas lost to Alabama week two? You guys know the drill. This is your CFB what if series where I take a result and I flip it and then I predict how that team would have done throughout the whole season and potentially the college football landscape. Remember, drop a comment and let me know the what ifs you guys want me to hit. So back to it. What if Texas actually lost to Alabama week two? They did end up winning 34-24, but going into that fourth quarter, Texas was down 13-16, to so it's not unrealistic to say that they wouldn't have potentially lost. So firstly, for jokes, everyone would have been saying if Texas lost that Texas is not back. Also, if Texas lost that game, I still don't think that changes the result of the OU game. I think they still would have lost that game. And then in standard Texas style for the last couple of years, they would potentially drop another game that they really shouldn't. Say like an Iowa State, TCU, Baylor. I think they would have ended the season nine and three, eight and four. And if you're telling me, well, they're just a way better team. College football is a sport of runs and momentum. With that momentum being shot in the first couple weeks, they would have probably had a lot worse of a season. So if that would have happened, the talks around Texas would have been they won't be able to hang next year in the SEC. And then finally, I think there have been talks that Sark is potentially on the hot seat if they have another year like this. Because we all know if you're not going to put Texas back on the map, you are out of town.